Hi, Year 2. Uh, today we're going to be writing the resolution, but before we start, we need to think about subordinating conjunctions. Now, I know last week you looked at subordinating conjunctions with Miss Head. Today, we are going to have a refresh and a recap to try and help us to embed this into our memory. So, before we start, I want you to see if you can remember three of the subordinating conjunctions you learned last week. You may like to pause this video. So, which ones did you remember? Was it because, so, as, when, after? Quite possibly, but there are many more. And there's two reasons that we use subordinating conjunctions. Either to say why something has happened or to say when something has happened. So why something has happened or when something has happened. They link two ideas together. And today you're going to be looking at because, so as and if for why something has happened. And after, before, while, when, until to describe when something has happened. Let's keep it simple. One idea, one clause, no conjunction. Example, I am happy. One idea, meaning one clause, no conjunction. Hmm. Two ideas means two clauses, I need a conjunction. Two ideas, I am happy, it's my birthday. How am I going to link these two sentences? Is this a why answer or a when answer? It could be both. I am happy when it's my birthday or I am happy as it's my birthday. Both of these work. And often you can choose whether you're trying to say why something has happened or when something has happened depending on what information you are trying to put across to your reader. Let's put this into action. My turn. Read the sentence, choose a subordinating conjunction, check the sentence. Cinderella ran to the castle. Something she could meet the prince. That's two pieces of information. I need a conjunction. Cinderella ran to the castle so she could meet the prince. So, she could meet the prince. Are there any others I could have used? Pause this video and see if you can have a think. They don't make sense, do they? Cinderella ran to the castle because she could meet the prince? It's a bit clunky. Cinderella ran to the castle as she could meet the prince. Cinderella ran to the castle if she could meet the prince. Stick with so for this one, I think. Next example, read the sentence, choose a subordinating conjunction, check the sentence, read the sentence. Cinderella had to clean the floor. They were very dirty. Two ideas. I need a conjunction. Pause the video. Which conjunction is the best for this? Or which conjunctions are the best fit for this sentence? Cinderella had to clean the floor because they were very dirty. Tick. Yes. Cinderella had to clean the floor, so they were very dirty. I don't think she would clean them to make them dirty. Cinderella had to clean the floor as they were very dirty. Tick. Cinderella had to clean the floor if they were very dirty. Tick. Cinderella had to clean the floor after they were dirty. Tick. Cinderella had to clean the floor before they were dirty. I don't think you clean the floor before it got dirty. Cinderella had to clean the floor while they were very dirty. That doesn't make sense. Cinderella had to clean the floor when they were very dirty. Tick. 
Cinderella had to clean the floor until they were very dirty. Oh, I don't think she's cleaning them to make them dirty, do you? So we could have chosen many of these different um, conjunctions and I'm going to say Cinderella had to clean the floor after they were very dirty. Actually, no. I think when they were very dirty. Cinderella had to clean the floor when they were very dirty. Last one. Read the sentence. Choose a subordinate in conjunction. Check the sentence. Something, it struck midnight. Cinderella had to leave the palace. Because it struck midnight, Cinderella had to leave the palace. So it struck midnight, Cinderella had to leave the palace. As it struck midnight, Cinderella had to leave the palace. If it struck midnight, Cinderella had to leave the palace. Because, as, if. They all work for this sentence, but they change the meaning of what is going to happen next. So think carefully about what you're trying to tell your reader. I'm going to say, because it struck midnight, Cinderella had to leave the palace. I could have said, after it struck midnight, before it struck midnight, when it struck midnight, but while and until would not have made sense for the sentence. Good morning, Year 2. It's time to write the resolution section of your text. Remembering today that our focus is going to be subordinated conjunctions that tell us extra information about why or when something has taken place. So we need at least two clauses linked with a conjunction. Now, not every sentence that we write today needs to have a conjunction in it, but it would be really great if at least two of your sentences could include conjunctions. So, what is the prince's problem? Well, the prince's problem is that he needs to find the girl from the party. So he needs to find the girl. Not any girl, he needs to find the girl that he fell in love with. So what is he going to do to be able to find her? Well, he remembers that she was really good at swimming. So he's going to arrange for a race And what is his test going to be? He wants to find the fastest girl. And when is the test going to be? The next day. Now I've planned out my ideas, I'm going to write them into four sentences remembering that I want to use my conjunctions. I'm going to say my sentence out loud. The prince was desperate to find the wonderful girl he fell in love with because he wanted to marry her. The prince, capital letter, was desperate to find the girl he had fallen in love with. Now I could end that there and put a full stop, but I want to say why. I want to give more information. So I'm going to say because he wanted to marry her. Full stop. So why did why did he want to find her? He wanted to find her because he wanted to marry her. Okay, what's my next question? 
when, what does he do? So he's going to arrange a race. He decided to make every girl in the kingdom enter a swimming competition. He, capital letter, decided to make every girl in the land he decided to make every girl in the land Swimming competition. Full stop. What does he do? He gets them to enter a race. What's his test going to be? He wants the fastest girl. So how can I put that into a sentence? I'm going to use when at the beginning of this sentence to make sure that I definitely include another subordinating conjunction. So how could I include when? When he found a girl who could beat him, he would know it was the athlete he had fallen in love with. When he found when he found Actually, I think I'm going to stick with the fastest girl. When he found the fastest girl, comma, he would know the athlete he had fallen in love with. Full stop. So what's his test? He wants to find the fastest girl. When is the test? I've said it's going to be the next one. So I'm going to start my sentence. The next day, the prince invited all the girls to a race at the palace. letter for prince. All of the girls to a race at the What does he do? He arranges the race for the next day. Now, I've included two subordinating conjunctions in my work, and that's what I'm looking for you to do today as well. So, the prince was desperate to find the girl he had fallen in love with because he wanted to marry her. He decided to make every girl in the land enter. Oh, that doesn't make sense, does it? This is why we need to reread our work little line to do that. He decided to make every girl in the land enter a swimming competition. When he found the fastest girl, he would know it was the athlete he had fallen in love with. The next day, the prince invited all the girls to a race at the palace. Full stop. Your independent task. You're ready. You've watched the shared writing. You know which conjunctions you need, need to be using in this lesson. 
Two, try and use two different subordinating conjunctions in your writing today. I know you can do it. I can't wait to read your work. <laughs>